Let's expand and simplify x plus 1 times x plus 3. So essentially, we're going to use the distributive law to do this. Some people use the FOIL law. That's kind of a helpful way to remember what we're doing here. So we're going to take the first terms. These are the first terms, x times x. That'll give us x squared. Then we'll take the outside terms, this x here and the 3 here. So x times 3, that's 3x. Next, we do inside. 1 times x, that's just x. It's 1x, we could just write x. And then the last term, 1 times that 3, that gives us 3. We can combine the 3x and the x, that'll give us 4x, and we end up with x squared plus 4x plus 3. So this is the expanded and simplified form of x plus 1 times x plus 3. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.